speak here, the decisions made by the past government yeah. were known when your party and the Labour Party contested the last election. Yeah. Now, Eamon Gilmore and indeed your own party's manifesto could not have been clearer that you said you knew the situation as it prevailed, as you're telling us now, nothing new in that, and that if people supported you, voted for you, yeah. you would do something different. We would, you, can yeah. I finish the point, Sorry. Simon, please? You didn't do that. You're talking now about paying a pay our way. The Taoiseach had the nerve to stand up in the Dáil today and say he didn't know who the Anglo bondholders are, but yet he was prepared to give one. We know who they are. Senator David Norris, I have the list of them here. Senator David Norris tried to read them into the record uh, into the Senate a while ago. We have Reuters today telling us that we know that Goldman Sachs and Rothschild, who are amongst the bondholders who are to be repaid, were advising the government in 2009 that we should repay the money back to bondholders. So they were recipients and advisors at the same time. Let and that's ask. the debt that you want. School children, people on social welfare, people suffering like the people in Limerick, uh, nurses, midwives being axed. They're the people who are paying the price. That's not our way. We didn't benefit from that. Just, and your government is asking us to pay for that. Let me just be crystal clear on this. Nobody wants to pay this money. Right? <laughs> this government doesn't want to pay this money. I don't want to pay this money. It is a galling decision. I absolutely agree with what Stephen said on this. Any, no, no, hang on a second. To want to no, pay he does not pay. want to pay this money. He's, okay. he's no, boasting is, about how we pay our way. Yeah, there is yes, an we will pay nuance. our way there because, because the consequences here. of not paying our way totally undermines all of the other good things that we've been doing. That